This is my Lumident LED headlight. I have it attached to my MedLight loops. I'm going to do a product review on the loops in the future. I'm just going to go over the parts of the light, uh, then kind of go over some of the you know the good and bad about the light. And I will show you an action shot. You know, I just you know show you the light, but um, on camera it comes comes off much brighter than it really is. I mean, it is a very bright light, but uh, for some reason, it, you know, I don't know how to adjust the camera to uh, to avoid that. I do have a picture on my blog post uh, that shows shows the light, but it's the same problem. But it kind of gives you a, a general idea how it looks. The light is very small. It's very light. Uh, that's one of the good features about it. Uh, this is your uh, filter uh, that you have to use when you're doing composites or sealants because Without the filter, it will start to cure the uh, the material. So you have to use this when you're working with that. Um, so it attaches to your loops. Um, you know, these, these come with all different kind of brackets to fit the particular loops you have. Um, if you go down along the wire here, uh, it comes with this nice little strap here that it, to uh, keep the cable you know, along the uh, the glasses here. And if you keep on going down, it's got um, comes with like a little clip here. That you can slide up and down uh, to clip onto your to your shirt. And the way this light is designed, the, uh, halfway down the cable, it'll disconnect. Uh, get that, grab the battery side of it. So it just disconnects like this. I think part of the part of the reason for that is to maintain the wire. Uh, a lot of times we tend to snag on things and yank the wire from the light so this uh, kinda helps avoid that so if we go down the wire and then this is the battery it comes with a nice uh, holding case with a clip that you can clip to your you know to your pants or your shirt and the way I have it set up in here is you know the wire goes through it uh, again to help maintain the wire and keep it in place and on the bottom here you got access point for the charging connection and on the you got some basic controls just on and off and then the intensity level me personally I like the light very intense I always have it all the way um, all right so some of the pros and cons I would say the um, it's probably the best bang for the buck uh, you can get out there for a light the retail price of the light is 500 bucks. They have a couple of discounts. One is a student discount. It's uh, 365 if you're a student. And if you're a Dental Town member, it's uh, 395 and that's what I paid for it. I also got a second battery. I like to have two batteries. Uh, you know, I use one, drain it, charge it, you know, have the other one charging, use that one to switch it. The extra battery cost me 95 bucks. You know, also comes with a carrying case. Uh, the light itself, I would say, is very is very bright um, compared to the more of the high end ones. I have a Sheer Vision light that's probably one of the brightest lights out there. It's um, I'm gonna show you right here. I'll just bring it over. You can see the size of this thing. It's uh, you know much bigger than the Lumident light, but um, it, but it's definitely heavier too. I don't mind the weight so much, but. Um, I started having problem with this light, and I'll I'm gonna do a review of this light you know, later on too. If I had to grade the brightness of the Sheer Vision as an A plus, I would probably say the Lumen is probably like a B plus, B minus compared to this, but it's um, definitely adequate. It's very good. Um, the other great thing about the Lumen Dent is the customer service. It's fantastic. It's probably one of the best experiences that I had with any company. Um, I send an email, I get an answer right away. Um, there's no real negatives about the light. Um, the only thing I would say is that you know it's not as bright as again like the high-end sheer vision if you're looking for like you know crazy brightness. But other than that it's um, it's pretty good. I mean the quality is good. Everything about the you know the filter to the light, the cable, the way it's set up. Um, you know, it's very good light. I highly recommend it. Um, I want to show you 
on the blog post, I'm going to have a picture of the light if you want to see it. But like, like I said, it's, it doesn't really show exactly how it looks because of the camera situation. All right. And I'll have all the information on the blog post. Uh, that's it. If you have any questions, you can send me an email. I'll answer them. All right. Thank you.